Hello and welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new. Bed Bath & Beyond. Are you ready? Let's shop. Guys, I've never done a video in this store. At least not since I've been back, since recently, since my channel has been, you know, since we've been here together. Um, I probably did one many, many years ago when I first started my channel and then I went away and then I came back and all the things, but hello. It's been a long time, so let's just say this is my first Bed Bath & Beyond video. Look at this beautiful lantern for $20. This little table, super cute, but I couldn't find the price. And so many things on sale or clearance. I think they refer to it as clearance. Lots of red stickers. All things red stickers is clearance and they have plenty of it. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Definitely let me know in the comments if you shop at Bed Bath & Beyond and if you like all the things. Maybe even what your favorite thing in here was, something like that. This table right here is metal and it was $50. This is such a beautiful candle. Look at how nice the pot is that it's in. Definitely a reusable container once you're finished burning the candle for sure this little set this little wicker set the two chairs the table 350 i think it's so beautiful so good now look at these reeds i think these are really pretty clearance price is 30 and then notice how they have this wood box thing please let me know are you supposed to hang it up this way or is this just the it must be that it's just like what it comes in right am i right or could, i mean i guess you could do whatever you want if you want to hang it up with the wood you know outer part you could i think it looks actually really cool with it but if you are going to take it out of there you could always use that wood part for something else i think it's really nice i love it never seen a wreath packaged that way so I was impressed and now look at all the red stickers this lantern is on clearance that was the other thing most of their items don't have the um, prices on the items obviously I'm so used to it though I kept looking for the uh, sticker for the price on the actual item but it's all on the shelf and I felt like they did a really good job on having the stickers on the shelf to the proper item you know a lot of the times you know oh I want to try not to say you know too much have you noticed I've been saying you know all the time give me give me a hashtag you know in the comments if you notice that I've been saying that a lot I need to stop OMG these lanterns that we just passed super cute this mushroom huge so so big and really lightweight $17 I thought that wasn't bad at all because it's so big here's this little chubby bird super cute of course all part of spring summer oh but I digress I just realized yes I was saying that for example, sometimes when we're at Target, the sticker doesn't match the item and, you know, I can't find... Oh, I did it. I said it. You noticed? Oh, stop. Please stop. I need to stop. Um, the items don't have prices on them at Target sometimes. So there's that. But anywho, Bed Bath & Beyond doing a great job with the prices. Here are some of the umbrellas for outdoors. This one is the most beautiful one with the little fringe and it's white. So summery, super pretty. Look at these throw pillows. Doesn't this print, if you know the brand um, Moschino, that's like that chevron look, but the way that they did it on those throw pillows, it reminded me of like a Moschino, Moschino, I think I'm saying it right, uh, print very you know high end and all that so i really like that this chair is fifty dollars it is like a lightweight aluminum metal type situation 
and then this one is so cute for the little kids for $15 that one is 40 I love the greenery here too very tropical they're giving us the tropical vibes for sure with the lanterns the wicker just all the things the plants love and then look at this one it doesn't get more tropical than a parrot right am i right i think so okay these so cute love solar powered and a bunch of variety i was trying to look to see if that price point for that um wreath that was up there was the same as the other one it had the red tag it is also thirty dollars so these little lanterns these were up here were five and then these are eight i thought those were so cute the colors and the shape of the lantern then these right here are ten dollars the one that looked like broken glass and these are the biggest ones out of these and they had them in these three colors now moving on to these clocks these are outdoor clocks which i think is so cool they have plenty of these and a little later in the video you will see well we're gonna go to like the regular indoor decor section and they have plenty of clocks in that section too love this picnic basket how cute and fancy is this if you want to have a nice little fancy picnic moment sixty dollars but you know it comes with all of the utensils and whatnot i thought this was so pretty how pretty is this like we've seen these everywhere walmart all the places have them but i love that they did this like print on it if that's what that you know the design on it i think it's really pretty and looks so pretty that middle one had a crack in it that's what i was trying to show you you see i'm looking for prices but they're not there but we're going to see them in a second but these are all the choices you have with the glasses or the drinkware I should say probably but those are all the prices right there super pretty I really like this lots of beach towels so so many these two I thought were really pretty the price point is also very nice $9.99 for most of them they're very big the ones that are like a little bit bigger you know there's like the $14.99 ones look at this print right here isn't this nice I thought that was really pretty like that nice light pink almost peachy color really good this one is nice and bright if you're more into the bright colors and then in this section there's more and these are 25 because these are like look it says luxury towel i was feeling it because let me tell you something the 25 dollars one was not as soft as the 9.99 one right that's crazy now here are some doormats they had quite a few to choose from live happy this is really pretty they have this one that says hello a bunch of these that are monogrammed which i think are really cool the only thing with these though welcome is that have you ever gotten one of these i have i think i did it for christmas one year and as soon as you you know start wiping your feet on it like the design goes away these tulip one love i thought that was my favorite one like that one is so pretty the tulips look so good but like i said as soon as you actually start using it that design goes away and i'm like eh what's what's the point which is why now i just have the hearth and hand one from target from you know that has like that same look but it doesn't have any design on it and i've been able to use it for like a couple of years already because it doesn't look like oh it's worn out because the design is gone you know oh <gasps> i said it guys easter on sale already and it's not even easter yet so some of the stores like this one already has certain things on clearance for easter so it's almost that time like that's what i always say i like to actually shop for whatever the holiday or season after the holiday because that's when you get you know clearance prices so 
yeah, Bed Bath & Beyond is already doing it. Love this little throw pillow right here. Really, really cute. It looks like, you know, like denim. I really like that. Then here is this. I was shocked. I had no idea that Ugg had bedding. Did you know that Ugg had bedding? Let me know in the comments and would you buy it? Look at how fluffy it is. I could never, I could never. For, I mean, it felt really good. It's nice. And if you're a person that's like cold all the time and needs as much warmth as possible, I'm sure it would be amazing. But for me, I run hot and I would be sweating so bad. So I could never do it, but it looked really, really nice and felt really nice too. This one right here was on clearance and I was actually surprised because I only went to it because of the little pom-poms, of course. And then it turned out to be so pretty because the back was like that um, sweater material and then the little pom-poms and clearance, jackpot, all the things. This one right here almost felt, felt like linen. It felt very light, very nice and soft. Now here we are getting into, like I mentioned earlier, the indoor decor section. This pineapple, not my style, but it lit up really nice. And I just love pineapple, so I like it. I admire it. I'm like, oh, this is so cute. Would I get it for myself? No, but I still think it's really nice. Here's some lavender. And then these I thought were really nice on clearance and they're in like a mason jar and it has that look of like water in there. Really cute. Here's more of these wreaths in these boxes. So now that I, I just realized, I didn't even think about this before while I was in the store. And by the way, it lights up. If you just saw that, it does light up. But yeah, now it makes sense. I guess that's just the, that's just the container it comes in. You're not supposed to hang it up with the box. But I just think it's like such a good little box. I would hope that anybody who gets any of those wreaths actually repurposes the little box. What do you guys think? Would you repurpose the box or would you be like, no, this is garbage. It's out of here. <laughs> I think it's so good. It's like, it's actual wood. Why wouldn't you like repurpose it? All of this greenery, again, so tropical, really pretty. I love these flowers, all on clearance. Oh, these little ones are so cute. You, you grow, girl. And then this one. I've soiled myself, so funny. I really like these. And I'm not a huge fan of like, all the little sayings and on pots or even little signs, like the little ones, like the ones that you see at the Target dollar spot that have all these little sayings that you can switch and all that. Um, but these were really cute. I really like those. I, I like the, the actual puns or sayings that are on there. This was so heavy super super heavy forty dollars it lights up really nicely here are all the things look at all these red stickers frames i feel like we'd never really looked at frames in any store and i had to show you these because clearance they're really pretty And then these wedding ones are so, so good. Bed Bath & Beyond has always had such a good wedding section, I feel like just, you know, wedding items. And I mean, I guess just in general, obviously like you can um, register there for your registry for your wedding and such. So very, very nice stuff. Please stay. I almost felt like I was gonna drop that. That's why I got a little scared. So yeah, I was looking for the prices and then I found them right here on the shelf. So, so good. I 
I actually, oh, I just remember, I can't believe I forgot. I actually used to work at Bed Bath & Beyond once upon a time, many, like literally over 25 years ago, probably a long time ago. I love this store. I think it's a great store. Their return policy is the best, like so good. Never seen such a good return policy in any store. So it's like safe to shop at Bed Bath & Beyond and know that if something goes wrong, you could bring it back for sure. No questions asked, nothing. OMG, these vessels, so good, $60, they're huge. They're not small at all. This one right here, love. How beautiful is this one? So, so perfect. Here's another hourglass. We keep seeing the hourglass everywhere. Now here's their rendition of it. This basket right here, it's, it's like a plastic, what is it? It's not a plexi, it's like a plastic, I don't know, I didn't like it, it's $20. I wasn't a fan, I didn't think it was, you know, the best. Here's those pineapples again, and then more greenery. This one is really pretty. I like that it has the little pebbles in there. The pot is really nice. That's 25. I don't like that price point. <laughs> I also don't like this $80 price point for this thing. It is big, but I mean, is it really worth $80? Not for me. And then this one, that's why I took it out because I'm like, I hope this is not like some small little thing. And it's not, it's longer for 40. These little pots right here, super cute now look at these lanterns these lanterns i thought were nice and different with the little swirly inside with the little lights very cute this one is really pretty this vase is so cool i love how it's like so small at the bottom so good now the wall of mirrors they have lots of mirrors of course they're running with the trend, $50 for the round one in black. They do also have it in gold. You'll see it in a moment. $20 for these like standard regular mirrors. Hello, hello. This one I thought was really cool because notice this, even though I'm kind of covering with my finger, but it has a kickstand. I was trying to show you the picture on there. It's, it has a kickstand. There was the gold one the round and then they also have these with the beading all the way around and then this i had to remove the one in the front to get to it that wood all the way around super nice fifty dollars for that Here's a clearance item, 40 for that one. These are so pretty. These were my favorite when it came to the like wall decor stuff that they have. It's like stone looking. It's not super heavy. And I was trying to look for the price and there was like no price to be found, but they're really pretty. I really like those. Here's another clearance one. I thought this one was really cute with the boots and the flowers. More florals over here. This mirror. I love this mirror. We saw something similar at Kirkland's. It's $300. I love that it like, did you see the crown molding? The mirror has crown molding on top and the bottom looks like a door. Like I said, we saw it, something similar at Kirkland's. Hi guys. I love this mirror so much. I was like, oh my gosh, look at me. Hi. <laughs> then these, $50 for these, like it's like dried lavender and other types of greenery in there. Love, I don't know why I'm loving like all wall art that involves whether it's these with the real stuff in there all dried or those other stone looking ones. Like I'm really gravitating towards artwork that has like that nice like um, 
but not so much necessarily flowers, just like greenery like this, you know? Oh, I said it. I guess really in the end, I'm gonna say it sometimes. I just don't wanna say it every other word. And I was about to say it just now and I stopped myself. Hooray for me. <laughs> oh, how cute is this? Love, I forgot about this. $40 though, that's a bit much. Doesn't it look like something that would be at Joanne's? Yes, right? Right? Yes. It looks completely like something that would be at Joanne's. It's also within the Joanne's price point. Oh, but let me not forget to mention this. It's Bed Bath & Beyond, and I'm sure everybody knows this, but just in case, you never know, they always have 20% off. That is fact. They will take it even if it's expired. They don't care. You can always get 20% offs at Bed Bath & Beyond. And by the way, if you made it this far, and maybe I don't even know at this point if it'll be in the title or not, but there's a haul at the end of this video. I will be showing you what I ended up purchasing. It's not a huge one, but you know, it's a whole nonetheless. Here's more of those um, like wedding ones and they're on clearance for $8. Now these wood initials, they're really big. I, like, I feel like you can't really tell how big they are. They're very big and they're only $5. And look, they have a little chain to like do whatever it is you gotta do with them. Here's more of these lavender wall art situations. And then they did have some of these signs, the big welcome one, then the bakery and the kitchen on clearance. And then I had no idea until I actually started moving them and touching them, they're metal. And that creamery one, so good. I wanted to make sure there wasn't anything missing. Yes, it's metal. I could not see the price for the big welcome sign. Now here is a bunch of candles. I could not like, I mean, look at this wall. It's a wall of candles, Yankee candles, all the things and lots of clearance ones. So if you're into candles, go to Bed Bath & Beyond for sure. Hey guys, so car haul. I managed to pick up a couple of things. I know I always say I don't shop while I'm filming, but today I couldn't give this up because I've been wanting to get into um, diffusers, you know, essential oils and such, and they had a ridiculous clearance. I didn't even show you this section because I saw it when I was about to walk out. So I just had to grab what I had to grab and get out of there. Let me show you the first thing. I'm so excited. So I got this, the Ilya, is that how you even say it? Ilya, Ilya, is it Ilya or Ilya? Do you know this brand? So this is one of the essential oils and it's called Get Going, Get Going Lance, listen, Lance Volt, listen, I don't know, but it says Get Going right there. And it smells really good. It says that it's 100% pure and all the things. So I'm going to look into this because it smells really good. And like I said, I've been wanting to get into essential, like diffusing essential oils. They smell so good. Whenever I smell them in other people's houses, I'm like, OMG, it's like a spa. I love that. Those are the kinds of scents that I love, even for um, like perfumes and stuff like that. So uh, yeah, I'm really excited and I'm gonna tell you how much everything cost when I'm done everything like as if it was so much It wasn't a lot. Okay, so It's a mini haul. It's a mini haul um, So another one is this one same brand everything is by this same brand for all this the diffuser stuff And this one is the eucalyptus of course number one love it so much 100% pure also by the way, it's Hometics, yeah, so it's really Hometics, and I guess it's the Ilya um, line, maybe. I don't know how it goes. I just know that this was $4. Wait, it might have even been less because apparently things were marked one way and then it was another. Okay, no, the eucalyptus. So this is the eucalyptus. Originally $9.99 and 
it was 60% off, so $5.99. So yeah, it was supposed to be $4. And then what happened to my coupon? Oh, they took the coupon. Yes. You know how uh, Bed Bath & Beyond has the 20% off coupons? They took the coupon off of the most expensive item, which makes sense. Please and thank you. Um, so yeah, so I got an additional 20% off on the diffuser itself because I got a diffuser. So I only got these two oils. The other ones, there was more, but the other ones were not like my pleasure. Plus I'm just starting out. I was like, let me try these two. Let me see how it works. Let me see if the diffuser itself works well. Are you ready? Look at this. What? Yes. Isn't this good? Oh my gosh, I think it might even light up. It might even light up, because look at all of these over here. Oh, no, it doesn't light up. It just has... Okay, so mine has, like, it's gray, it looks like, and then it has, like, this beige. But, yeah, and that's the one in the middle here. I was going to say, like, it's probably hard to see, but there's different ones with different bottoms, like a pink, a yellow, and all of that. I'm glad that this one is, like, the all-neutral one, you know. You know how I do. I like all the neutral things. It says that it diffuses for six hours straight. Again... Hometics, which I've heard of. I mean, I've heard of this. This is not like a no-name situation. So I got that, the two oils, and what I really went in there for, but then I decided to go ahead and film for all of us, um, was this. <laughs> like, almost TMI right here. But yes, I use this, the Flawless. I use it all over my face. It's so good if you never tried it and you want to get rid of all of like your peach fuzz and all that. That is the way to go. It's the best one. I've even tried like the other type of like micro, micro, is it micro peeling? I don't know what it's called, but you know, I've tried other things. That is the best. Let me show it to you again. Flawless. Yes. So good. Okay. Let's break it down. So the flawless situation is 20 no discount no anything but that goes for 20 dollars. guys the diffuser the actual diffuser 60 dollars original price 60 percent off so it was 35.99 off that's what they used my 20 percent off coupon so an additional 480 off so i paid 19 yeah 19 dollars and 20 cents Again, the eucalyptus um, essential oil was originally $10, $5.99 off, so I paid four. And then, oh my gosh, the other essential oil is original price $20. Original price, blah, blah, original price, look, it even happens here. <laughs> original price $20. It was $11.99 off and I paid $8. What? My total price was $55.80. So that is my haul. That is everything. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to click the notification bell so you won't miss my next video. Subscribe, of course. Let's keep shopping together and I will see you in the next one. Bye.